Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So, para sa vlog na to, we're gonna be doing a doing makeup look using affordable makeup brands. So, mostly ng mga makeup na gagamitin ko is mga drugstore makeup brands na nabibili ko lang sa Walmart, sa Shoppers, sa London Drugs, mga ganon. So, anyways, let's start this makeup video now. So, I know, medyo mukha akong buluha ngayon, but it's getting warmer na dito sa amin. So, First of all, if you're gonna do a makeup look, make sure na na prep mo na yung skin mo. So make sure that you washed your face already and you did your skincare. So I honestly did my skincare like before I even started filming. For my primer, I'll be using this Elf Putty Primer. Like ito talaga yung go-to primer ko every time na magbe makeup ako. Then kakalat ko lang sa. So every time na magbe makeup ako, ang unang katulad ng ginagawa is yung kilay ko. Hindi na huli ko yung face makeup ko. So for my brows. I usually use this one for brow pencil ng Morphe. And ito siya. Like, I honestly prefer this one kasi manipis siya. I honestly wanted to do sana yung laminated brows. But honestly, it doesn't look good on me. Like, I tried, but it just doesn't really look good talaga. I mean, hindi ko talaga siya bagay. Hindi ko alam kung mali lang ako na ginagawa or talagang hindi ko siya bagay. Pero, I honestly tried a lot of products na to laminate my brows. And I honestly look weird whenever I try to laminate my brows. Then, I'll be doing the other side as well. Nagamit ako nitong Thicket Sticket ng NYX. It's like a brow mascara. And, it does work as a brow laminator then. But, it honestly doesn't work with my brows. Talaga. I don't know why, but it doesn't really work so for me. Dahil siguro makulit yung brows ko. Kaya ganon. Ayan, tingnan nyo. Para siya malaminate, diba? It kind of looks weird talaga for me. Maya maya tingnan nyo, bababa dito. Like, it won't stay like that for a long time. Kaya, very ekis na ako sa mga brow laminator stuff. So, it doesn't really hold my brows. Then, I'll definitely put a concealer. And for my concealer, I'll be using this NYX Bear With Me Concealer. For me, ha? Like, personally, I am obsessed with this concealer. Like, it's not drying. Super dali niya i-blend. Kasi there are some concealers talaga na kahit kakalagay mo lang, ang hirap na lang i-blend agad eh. But this one, hindi. Super dali niya i-blend. So, lilinisin ko lang yung konting part ng kilay ko. Like, ayoko na makasin eh, hindi yung kilay ko. Natatakot ako. So the last time that I did it by myself, pinagsisihan ko na sobra. At itong kilay ko talaga na ito, medyo may pagkapasaway. After nyan, ibablend ko lang sila using a beauty blender. Basta yan. And I'm using this Stay All Night Micro Setting Mist ng ELF. And I'll just blend this out. So ayan, I ended up like adding a little bit on this side. Hindi ko masyadong manipis tong isang side na to. So, yeah. Hindi ako masyadong sanay na medyo ma na super ma yung kilay ko. Kaya, ayan. But, medyo magkahawig naman na sila. So, I'm not gonna touch it anymore. So, ayan na sila. And then, maglalagay lang ako ng concealer din sa eyelids ko. Papump ako ulit dito ng konti. And, gagamitin ko tong beauty blender ko to spread it through my eyelids. So, ayan. And, ganun din sa kabila. Since I'm wearing pink shirt, I kind of decided to just do like like pinkish tones. And for that, I'll be using this palette from Cara Beauty. And ito yung Shades of Me na palette nila. And ayan yung mga kulay. I'll pretty much start off with this one. Lalagay ko lang siya dito. Parang hindi siya nakakita. Then I'll use this shade doon katabi niya. Medyo darker ng konti. And I'll just put it on top of that kasi hindi mag-pop out yung pagka-pink nitong una kong shade na nilagay. So, ayan. Nakukulangan ako. So, I'll definitely use this, like, Chasing Rainbow palette. And I'll use this one. And it will definitely make my eyes pop. Tingnan nyo. Ayan o, diba? I'll just put it over here. Like, sa dulong part ng kit ng eyelids ko. Ayan o, diba? And I'll use a different brush to kind of spread it out through my eyes. Dito sa bandang taas. So the only thing about this palette is puro uh, matte yung shades niya. Wala siyang shimmer shade. So I'll using this one, yung white na to. 
And it is a shimmer shade talaga. Like, ayan siya. It's very blinding talaga. I even use this one as highlighter sometimes kasi super ganda ng shade niya. I'll just put, like, over here in the inner part of my eyelids. And I'll definitely put, like, this one. Like, itong chunks ng glitters sa gitna ng eyes ko. And just put it over here. And then, kukuhan ko ulit tong brush na to. Yung ginamit ko kanina sa dark na pink. I mean, the sahulin shade na ginamit ko from, like, the, the, like this one. And kukuha ako ng konting pigment. And maglalagay ako ulit. To kind of just blend it out with, like, the shimmer shade na nilagay ko. Over there. And, and yeah, tapos na tayo sa eye makeup natin. And then, for, like, the eyeliner... They pretty much don't use like black eyeliners, but instead they use like brownish tones. So I'll definitely use this one and gagamit lang ako na parang regular na parang pang paint brush. Like for face, like SFX makeups. Kasi ito is medyo manipis nipis siya. Like if you guys can see. Just ayan. And I'll definitely do my eyeliner now. So. And very, very subtle na wing lang yung gagawin ko. Ayan, ganyan lang. Then, I'll do the same on the other side. So, ayan, I ended up putting my contact lenses na dun as well. So, the next thing that I'm gonna do is probably put mascara on and put, like, the falsies. And as you notice, as you can see, parang medyo nag-fade tong like shimmer shade that's okay i'll just like do some touch-ups like later so anyways for my mascara i couldn't find the mascara that i usually use but instead i'll be using this mascara no l'oreal and maganda din naman siya it's just that i still prefer like which is yung like lash princess na essence na kulay pink but i don't know where i put it like the last time that i use it so this will do. <laughs> and sha, like straight na pal yung wand. So, ayan. I'll put like maybe a couple of coats, then I'll put the falsies. Like, no, like, start pa lang ako mag makeup. I couldn't really understand kung bakit kailangan mo pang maglagay ng mascara if you're gonna put like falsies on top of it naman. Like, ano yung isip ko nun is. Di naman makikita yung like real na eyelashes mo when you're wearing falsies. So what's the point of like putting and doing your eyelashes like when you're gonna put like falsies on top of it naman. Then as like I watched like a lot of like beauty gurus back then, like they did explain na the reason for that is para mag blend yung real lashes mo don sa false eyelashes mo. Yung know, ang reason. So, ayan guys. Unang coat pa lang siya. Like, medyo makapal na agad, diba? Like, can you guys see? Especially, like, this one. Then, for my lashes, I'll be using this lashes that I bought from Timu. And, ayan siya. Manga lashes siya. I'll be putting this off camera kasi every time na naglalagi ako ng falsies, super tagal ko talaga magkabit na to. So, I'll be right back once I successfully put it in my eyes na. So, wait lang. So, ayan na guys. Nalagay ko na yung falsies. For my foundation, itong foundation na ito yung gamitin ko, which is yung Fit Me Foundation ng Maybelline. Pag magagalagay ako ng foundation na nasa bottle, lagat itong walang pump. Ay, ang dami. So, usually, nilalagay ko lang siya dito. And, konting patak lang talaga yung ginagamit ko muna. Nagamit ako ng flat brush pang spread lang sa fess. Pang karat lang na ganyan. Para makuha ko pa rin yung uh, coverage na gusto ko. And, kapag nagkulang kong pinang ko, doon lang ako magdadagdag ng product ulit dito. Para hindi sayang. So, yan na ngayon yung mukha ko. Kakatakot, diba? It's scary. After na tong brush na to, gagamit ako ng gantong brush. Para ma-buff ko lang. O ma-buff. Para ma -like, mapantay ko yung foundation sa mukha ko. And I'm just gonna do like a tapping motion para i-spread ko tong foundation ko like equally. 
So, ang next na is concealer ulit. And then, same thing. Dito ako maglalagay ng concealer and konting product muna. And then, nagamit ako ng brush para i-apply itong concealer. And, tatakpang ko din yung mga hinanakit ko sa mukha. I'm gonna use like a beauty blender again. Kind of spread it evenly. Yung concealer na nilagay ko. And, ayan. I'm gonna set the concealer that I put using this translucent powder ng Wet n Wild. And obvious na obvious naman, di ba, na super gamit na gamit na sa akin. Kasi nabubura na yung tatak, yung nakaprint dito na photo focus na translucent powder. So I'm just gonna put like, the translucent powder like sa lahat ng spots na nilagyan ko ng concealer to just kind of bake it and set it para hindi siya mag-crease. And now we're like we can do like the bottom eyelids na finally habang binibake natin to. I'm just gonna use a small brush kasi sa ilalim lang naman ng mata eh. I'm gonna use this palette, yung Chasing Rainbow palette ng Colourpop. And I'll be using this bright pink over here. And I'm just gonna put it like over like at the bottom edge corner of my eyelids. And ayan. And then I'll probably blend it out because it's too bright. And hindi siya parang ganong kakulay nung mata ko sa taas. I mean, natong eyeshadow ko sa taas. But, yeah, I'm just gonna blend it out. And I'm definitely gonna use this palette. I'll probably use this shade. I'll just put it under here to kind of create that illusion. From inner corner to like palabas. Can it do anything? And then I'm gonna use like this small brush again to grab this shimmer shade and ilalagay ko siya dito sa inner part ng kapalabas. And I'll definitely put a little bit of pink again, but this time I'll put this medyo light na lang to kind of blend it out long naman. And then of course I'm gonna put like some mascara for my bottom lashes as well. So I'll use the translucent powder since matagal tagal naman na. So the next thing I'm going to do is mag contour na ako. Tong chocolate strawberry face palette na I Heart Revolution. Ng gamitin ko. Ato mag contour na ako and I usually do just like dabbing motion as well. Pati kasi pag ganun ako pag line. But, sabi na lang mas okay daw if pag ganun. I'll be doing like what they call reverse contouring. So, I'll grab like this one, like your leftovers na lang. I'll just tap it on the side of my nose. Then, pag, pag din naman agad. And then for my blush, so I'll be using this e.l.f. Putty Blush. And it's honestly my go-to blush then. You can use it using your fingers, using your brush, or even using your beauty blender. But for now, I'll be using this like brush. And I'm gonna set it. I mean, I'm gonna spray it with my setting spray as well. And the dab 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 ko lang siya. And... I usually put some over here in the bridge of my nose and also over here, such in, and also here in my forehead. And for the highlighter, I'll be using this Praline highlighter palette. Ayan siya. I'll grab a highlighter brush and put it over here. Then do the same at the other parts where I want to highlight. So usually, if it's the nose area, I just, I just use my fingertips and apply it directly the norm. And then for my lips, I honestly want to achieve that since I wanted to do like an ombre lips, I'm gonna put concealer on my lips. I'll probably use this one. This one is from Colourpop. No wala na yung logo ng Colourpop na brand na. But ito yung Uncloud Dynasty na lipstick nila. And the like na siya dito sa inner part. And I'll blend it using my fingers. And usually, sa gantong makeup look, medyo nakalagpas talaga yung lipsticks nila. Especially sa upper part. Parang nakalagpas talaga siya. 
nagpa-prepare na ako ng content sa itsura ng labi ko. So, I'll use this like eyeshadow palette as my lips and I'll definitely like use this one like the darkest shade and put it in the middle in the inner and then of course I'll be using one of my yummy gloss na cover girl and I'm using this shade yung you're just jelly na shade nila lalagay lang ako ng konti Overline ako. So, I'll be finalizing this makeup look here as well. I'll be back with my final look, guys. So, wait lang. Uptown, on the road. I've been around the floor. Rooftop, sliding doors. Just wanna know you more. I hope you wanna be a song that. So, there we go, guys. So, this is the final look for this makeup look. <laughs> Honestly, I'm kind of disappointed with how this lips turned out. Kasi kanina, hindi ganyan yung kulay niya talaga. Ayan. Ganyan yung itsura niya kanina. Like, very subtle. Siguro kakadagdag ko nung parang dark shade dito sa loob. Then, while spreading the lip gloss, siguro kumalat siya ng kumalat kaya naging... Ganyan yung kulay niya. I'm honestly contented with the whole makeup look that I did. And before I forgot, hindi ko napakita sa inyo na gumamit ako ng setting spray. And itong setting spray na to, yung ginamit ko ulit. So, yeah. So, wag niyo na masyadong pasinin yung hair style. <laughs> Kasi ilo yung nakayan ako. I have no idea how to fix my hair or to style it. And I also have no patience at all <laughs> to do my hair. Kaya, pagsyagaan niyo na yan. Like, pwede na yan kahit hindi ganun kabagay sa makeup look. So, yeah. That's it for this makeup video, guys. Thank you so much for watching and for staying with me. I do hope you guys liked and enjoyed this makeup video as much as I enjoyed doing this vlog. And please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and to subscribe to my channel as well. And feel free to follow my social media accounts over here. And yeah, I'll see you guys on my next YouTube video. So, bye! Oh mm -hmm.